Welcome to my channel. Everything you need to know about mindful eating. When we lead demanding lives with a crammed daily schedule, it is easy to be mindless during a meal, one can finish an entire plate of food and not taste even a single morsel. Research and studies have found that mindful eating, changing the way we consume our meals and reconnecting to the actual experience of eating, is more important than what we have on our plates. Why it's crucial when we eat under stress, in a rush, or while undergoing emotional upheaval, it affects not only what we eat, but how we digest it. Your body may not absorb all the nutrients effectively. Paying attention while eating ensures the grub is digested better. Anticipating the delicious flavor of the freshly cooked food leads the brain to inform the stomach that it should prepare for a meal and a number of digestive activities are put in motion, from salivation to releasing enzymes. The practice of being aware during a meal includes healthful benefits ranging from reducing your weight and body mass index BMI. Dietitian and sports nutritionist Deepshika Agarwal says, yes, mindful eating is helpful for weight loss. But it takes time to inculcate the patterns and practices that need to be followed. It is also known to help one cope with eating disorders like anorexia and bulimia, control overeating and binge eating and also improve symptoms of type 2 diabetes. Defining it Mindful eating is all about paying undivided attention to your plate of food, the colors, flavors, textures and even the sounds that chewing food makes. Deepshika says, it makes us aware of nutritional needs, the nutrient values of food and how to achieve fullness without falling prey to high calorie cravings. According to the Center of Mindful Eating, it is allowing yourself to become aware of the positive and nurturing opportunities that are available through food selection and preparation by respecting your inner wisdom. It is about using all your senses and choosing to eat food that is satisfying as well as nourishing to your body. It acknowledges responses to food without judgment and also makes you more aware of hunger and satiety cues to guide your decisions in eating. What does it entail? Mindful eating is not about a diet, or about giving up anything at all, says nutritionist Sheila Tana, adding, you can eat even a cheeseburger mindfully and enjoy it a lot more. Or you might decide, halfway through that your body has had enough and that it really needs some healthy salad instead. That way you will automatically control your portions. And also, because you are eating slowly, you will feel full faster, and adopt healthy food habits without getting frustrated. How to do it? Sheila says, while eating anything put the fork or spoon on the table after you take a bite. Chew slowly. Do not talk or multitask while eating. Tune into the texture of the food, the flavor of the cheese, herbs, masalas and spices, the bright color of the sauce in the bowl, plate and the aroma of the rising steam from the hot food. Continue this way throughout the course of your meal, and you'll experience the third eye-opening pleasures of mindful eating. Mindful eating of raw food gaining prominence Chefanese Khan says, it is very important to build a healthy relationship with food, and it should not be only about fueling the physical body. It should nourish the mind and soul as well. Food, should give us life, cleanse our body and uplift our spirit. Mindful eating of raw foods is finding a prominent place in today's society owing to the many health benefits it offers. Food that is old, decomposed and consisting of dead flesh will pollute the body and consciousness, while food that is fresh, nutritious and free of any suffering will enrich the body, cleanse the mind and satisfy the soul. A raw vegan or raw animal food diet consists of unprocessed, unpasteurized and unhomogenized foods that have not been heated above 40-49 degrees Celsius. Anise adds, advocates of raw cuisine argue that raw or living foods have natural enzymes, which are critical in building proteins and rebuilding the body, and that heating these foods above the prescribed limits destroys the natural enzymes and can leave toxic materials behind. Dimensions of Mindfulness It is about how to base our meals on physical cues provided by our body. Here are the questions you should ask yourself when you sit down to eat. Can I taste each bite of what I am eating? 
Do I feel low energy slash empty before I sit for a meal and do I feel very full when I finish eating? Do I feel distracted and keep planning my day ahead when I sit for a meal? Do I feel guilty or disappointed about the food I eat or do I feel joy, pleasure? What kind of thoughts does this food bring to my mind, my mind?